Meghan Markle dominant, how she charmed Elizabeth II. Many observers of the Royal Family of England assured that Meghan Markle was the darling of Queen Elizabeth II before the famous Maxit when she joined the Royal Family of England. Meghan Markle turned the habits of Queen Elizabeth II upside down or granted her certain privileges to which Kate Middleton was not entitled the origin of their rivalry. For example, she was able to spend Christmas in Sandringham in 2017 when she was only Prince Harry's fiancée. Before the wedding, she was also invited to Vincent Castle, the former actress of Suits, quickly entered the good graces of the Queen and according to the biographer Colin Campbell, specialist in royalty, it was the dominant personality which allowed her to do so. Meghan had his very dominant personality and she was never afraid to enter a room and then take control. She did this with everyone her whole life and saw no reason to change by joining the royal family, Colin Campbell told the Daily Star. And strangely, it was this dominant side taken by many British observers as insolence or arrogance that would have placed the Queen from the start. The Queen adores dominant and playful personalities. Meghan can be very playful, charming and seductive. Meghan asserts itself even more since the Mexit. This strong personality could however be lacking in Meghan Markle when distancing herself from the month of March, but she has even become more assertive since she returned to live in the United States with Harry and Archie. Since she is now the only mistress of her communications, she has now taken a stand in anti-racist struggle that has been raging in North America since the death of George Floyd, which her rank in the royal family might not have allowed her.